this is not a poem. More of a dedication to the patient. Ones who seek God's face in the city. Those who wait to catch the sunrise even if only into grey skies because it reminds them of the majesty of their Lord. Those who seek the sun's decline behind graffiti pattern railway lines. Praying for orange and red light to paint blast the sky because they realise if you look close enough, God always sends us signs. Even when street lamps dull the stars in the sky, they try. Even though high-rise buildings barricade the skyline, they try. See, we are not the ones with desert nights, where the full moon gives enough light to read scriptures by bedsides. We are the ones who can't make it out to sacred lands, to sit at the feet of the enlightened, who teach the mysteries of Allah with the subtleties of silence, whose very fragrance is guidance for the now-guided seeker, who now sleeps in sacred villages where London London becomes a dirty nightmare they'd rather forget. No street fights, no police sirens, no forced right children. No people trying to earn a living on broken pavements to pay rent. This is for those who seek muster for the chosen one. In the land of the frozen sun. Where we use machines that blow heat to help us sleep. But each night here, there are those who dream of the unseen and catch a gleam of his reality. Waking up in tower blocks with the unwavering conviction that there is a God. This is for those who seek Allah in the city. Looking for light in a land of dark days and dark nights. Tense hearts and bitter minds to those who still seek the light in people's eyes because they know we are all a manifestation of God's signs and everyone is reaching for him, even if they don't realize. This is for those with mercy in their eyes, whose prayers have the power to pierce the sky. Irregardless of where they reside, God always hears his servants cries. Allah always hears his servants cries to those who ride the train reading sacred scrolls for masters of the soul causing their hearts to explode and come back together between oxford street and tottenham court road they cause the carriage to glow yet nobody knows the columns of angels follow them wherever they go there are saints in our city didn't you know friends of allah walking down the high road to those who clutch prayer beads tight their intimate companions in the depths of the night and as each bead passes through fingertips, his most beautiful name stains their lips and they send salawat upon the Prophet until they no longer exist. Their bodies exist in the metropolis, but their souls have found bliss. And to those seekers who learn from online teachers and download khutbas from iTunes and add it to their iPod playlist, exchanging YouTube videos on Facebook pages, because we crave this knowledge of the sacred. These virtual sages boost our faith in the city. To those who have come to the conclusion that this whole world is an illusion that will one day fade and all that will be left is God's face. To those who seek Allah's grace in the city for you, I dedicate this. Woo!